Who the hell are these white people? Um. Okay, look, look, look. Okay, I don't know. Okay, the baby girlfriend, <laughs> girlfriend, girlfriend. Oh, Dana Lee, Danny. Okay, Danny Lee. Dane, I listen, y'all. This she is so irrelevant to me. I swear to God, she is so corny. I don't know. She her face be giving like she wants to be like that face is giving a little cancerian, but it kind of also gives um I don't know. I want to say cap. Well, this you know what her son has to be somewhere near her rising because she has a squarish uh forehead. Okay. That's my theory. So let's go look at this shit. Okay, so. Um, okay, so she is apparently this. I don't like this chart, but don't worry about it, y'all. Let me go build it right here. She is. Oh, she was born in Florida. She's going through her sat Saturn return. Uh huh. Uh huh. Cause you didn't prepare. Use a dumb. This is what this is what happens when you live in computer mode. <laughs> How you like? I don't get it. All that access to the internet and you can't find you a, a spiritualist, a witch, or something, a teacher, a mentor. I'm not understanding. Oh my god. Miami, Miami. I'm just gonna put Miami. Okay, look at it real quick. So I just want to show you her. Oh, yeah, I knew it. Look, I knew she... I can smell us. I knew the chick had cancer. Look at that face, y'all. Look at Danny Lee, the Danny, Danny, whatever. Danny Lee, little rascals, whatever. She... Look at the face. You see that roundness? You could just... Whenever you see them next to, like... Look, she's next to another cancer. Look how round or full that... Even... She, and she's skinny. So, look how round that face is. Um... Okay. This is... Look. So, look. She has Saturn opposing Mars. She has a... She's a different story. I'd be trying to tell you. Um... So, she has Saturn opposing Mars. Mars is driving... Uh, <coughs> whatever. And she's skinny. I'm trying to tell you. That cancer is everywhere. Anyway, so she has Mars opposing Saturn, which is now her Saturn return. Look, she's going through her Saturn return literally right now, y'all. Look, Saturn is at 7 degrees in her chart. And Saturn is currently at 7 degrees. Look at that right there. Look. Look at the transit. Saturn is... Wait, what? Saturn is at six degrees, not even on her Saturn return. That means she's going to feel it twice. She's tight. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's crazy. I do not wish her anything bad, but she's going to feel it twice for a fact. <laughs> um, okay. Let's see. Let, then she has, what else? She had, what else is this? Two degrees. Okay. The North Node is at two degrees, which would go over her Jupiter it would go over that Lilith 2 and Mercury. Look, driving. Look, I told you she had a Capricorn placement. I'm telling, even if I know this. Okay, so she's not a Capricorn rising because if she was, Mercury would be in the rising and she would be very good at articulating herself, which she does not. Um, so your Saturn return starts right when Saturn is above it. Saturn return starts exactly when Saturn enters the sign of your own thing. That's when you start feeling it. The first hit is when Saturn is right on it or near your own Saturn. So you see Saturn is at 6 degrees currently. Hers is at 7 degrees. Which means in about a day or two, it's going to go right over that. Whenever Saturn decides to go... Let's see. Whenever Saturn goes 7 degrees, that's when... Look, right there. Right there. So look, Saturn goes at her 7 degrees on June 2nd. We should hear something... Um, we should hear something about her on June 2nd. I don't know what about her, but we're going to hear something about her. Why? Because Saturn is going to be right on her own Saturn. It's going to be co coming into contact. It's going to play out. It's going to do its thing. Mind you, she's going through her nodal reverse. 
going on here. Um, where's Mars and Leo? Leo would be somewhere here. I don't know. By the way, we don't. We're just guessing. We don't know her time of birth. By the way, I just want to let you know. Look, this is happening right now. So Venus went over her moon, right? Currently, that's when I guess she got charged, or the whole world knows about that. She has a she has a she has a good moon. That she acts she actually has a good moon, literally. So that's the funny part. Okay, what else is happening here? So the the Venus is coming into a direct opposition to Uranus. Look, look at that shit right there. Venus is at 25 degrees Cancer and is coming to a direct opposition to Uranus. Uranus rules people. The the um she had an ascending on the other chart. Yeah, I don't trust this chart. I don't this chart right here. That's what you're talking about. I don't listen. I don't trust the man. You trust the man. I don't trust the man. This website they knew they not they not loyal to the astrology community. They knew to this, not true to this. They think they and mind you, what they do is they put the 12. The, all they did was put the 12 hour or the 12 p.m. and the rising. That's how they got the Pisces ascending. Maybe she is a Pisces rising. I don't know. Um, but I just wanted to see what else come into contact. So look, her Mars, look, her Mars. Sorry, I just wanted to say this. Her Mars, which is what she used the car, right? Car is driving, cars, Mars is cars, is coming into a direct contact to look. That Jupiter and the North Node. Remember when I told you that Jupiter is not that great? I told you this all the time. Jupiter is not that freaking great. I am telling you guys this. I will not lie to you about why is Jupiter not that great. Well, you need to learn where your Pisces and your Sagittarius house is located. That's what you need to know. She doesn't give Pisces rising as a Pisces rising. She is not a Pisces rising. Baby, she is not a Pisces rising. She is not. Cause she people she would be more likable. Like when Pisces whenever you have a water sign as the rising sign, the whole world comes to your rescue. Everybody wants to protect you. Oh my god, don't do that to them. No, protect them. Because they're water sign. Because so when she did that stupid ass song, the yellow bone song. And nobody came to her rescue. That's how I knew that she's at, she's got to be a Capricorn, right? She got to be an Earth sign or a fixed sign. They they're not really liked by others. <laughs> she does not give Jupiter mommy for real. She does not give Jupiter mommy because Jupiter mommies look good and they're loved by everyone. They get marries, okay? Jupiter ladies, they get they get they walk they get to walk down the aisle. You hear? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Um, somebody says, yes, I notice how they're labeled mothers. Exactly. W water signs. Just had my Jupiter return. It was hell. I be trying to tell you these, I, like they be tricking y'all the, the man. Why you need to, Jupiter's not that great. Let me tell you, I'm, I'm going to put her rising. I'm going to put her sun in the rising. Cause we know she's a Sag. So let me show you what happened to her as a sun sign. Let's go to her sun sign. She's a Sagittarius. Let's go to the Sag. I'm going to show you exactly what happened. She's not a very smart girl. Okay. So if you put Sagittarius, she's been, she's, she's just been humiliated. I, I'm just trying to tell you. Okay. So this is, um, what is this called? This is Sag. Okay. So she's a Sagittarius rising, whatever. No, not a Sagittarius. She's a Sagittarius sun. Excuse me. Right. Jupiter would have entered this sixth house of problems. That's why I tell you, Jupiter's not that great. Because if she's a Sag, Jupiter is now one, two, three, four, five, six signs away. The sixth house is pending karma, the drama, the problem. Shit, even if it's not Virgo in there, it still acts like a Virgo. This is the house that you got to do more work for. Thank you. So the third house is driving. For all Sagittarius's, Pluto is teeter totting from these two areas, from second to third. So it went from your third house to your second. What about male with a water rising? Does he give father? No, he does not. He gives, uh, he gives Kanye West. That's a good question, though. Good job. Look at you. Only men are men are meant to have fire 
and um and some to some earth signs. Okay, men that are fire and earth, they're they're gonna give more masculinity, more more structure, more foundation. Water sign men give like you you wanted to become a mother, right? If you get, let me tell you something, more than likely you get send a water sign man, right? Because you probably had an abortion. I'm sorry. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, okay. How does this affect Sag Rising? Hilarious. You guys are hilarious. I swear to God. <laughs> Again, the sixth house rules work, health, daily routines, problems, commun um, your siblings, uh, aunts, uncles, aunts and uncles from your mother's side, the people that work for you. I don't know, Sag, rising. How has been your job for the last year and a half? How has been your coworkers or your health? Have you been able to pay bills? How has your driving, you used to be, some of you used to be the greatest drivers. Some of you just had Pluto switch in there. We don't know. You feel me? A water sign man is the biggest. I had an abortion by a cancer man. Yeah, so honestly, if you want me to keep it a stack with you, I'll keep it a stack with you. You get a water sign man or a very watery kind of man and um, when you have an abortion. So if you had an abortion, right, and you get a water sign man, I'm just saying, <laughs> it's your karma, baby. I've been a road rage like a bitch. I know you guys used to be the best drivers, but I don't know what's going on. Guaguan, my what is going on? Um, yes, I was a good driver. What is happening? You? What about very air sign men? See the difference with air, very air sign men. Um, they are on a mission. The problem with air sign men, they're on a mission to reach their highest desires. Um, and that's the problem unless you're willing to be his friend. See, people don't understand that when you dating air signs, you're supposed to be their friend. You're not supposed to date an air sign. You're supposed to be their friend. I just want to let you know, got me scared to drive. Um, stop my baby daddy's and I had two abortion and miscarry. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying you could do better. <laughs> ah, chicken. That, I'm sorry. That was, the, I, I'm trying to tell you, I'm not, I figured it out. I figured it out. I did my time already though. You hear me, God? I did my time. Thank you. Sorry. Just wanted to let you know. Friend and air sign. Yes. Yeah, so if you are dating an air sign men, you need to be his friend, not his lover. Okay. They're not good with love. They're good with friends. There you go. F what about fire sign men? Not nah, fire sign men. They're you already know. That's I just told you fire sign men are who you want to be with. They're the passionate ones. They're going to fucking open doors. They're going to be rough and aggressive and you're going to have to tame that wild side. Um, they'll hold your door violently. You know what I'm saying? Like, or they're the ones that you'd be like, I don't want you to do it. It's okay. And they'd be like, shut up. I'll do it anyways. They're going to do it anyways. Okay. So that's why I like me a fire sign and a cat. I'm telling you. There's a whole, I'm, I have Capricorn in the seventh house. I got it all figured out. I did my karma. You hear me, God? I already did it. Thank you very much. Um, so I just want you to know, um, when God, that's how you know. If fire sign check, I'm trying to tell you. Earth sign is a check. Okay? That's what, it, uh, fire signs is what you want. As a, Now, if you are a fire sign woman, let's stop right there. If you're a fire sign woman, and you get a water sign man, that's okay. That is, you got, you switch roles. You guys have, you guys were with each other in the past life and you switch roles. So you was the man in the past life and he was the girl or whatever the fuck it is. Um, you get the point, but you get what I'm saying. So anyways, yes. So Jupiter is not that great. I just want you to bring that up. It's a topic here. Um, yeah, just want to let you know. So she was going to get this karma no matter what. Look, even the 11th house, right, is ruled by Venus and her Venus is in the 12th house. She was going to take a loss from the audience anyways. They don't like her. 
We don't like you. What she did was, what she, what Dana Lee did was her Jupiter rules husband or expansion. Mars is it comes to a square to her Mars, which is boyfriend. She found a way to expand herself via her boyfriend. Now, this is not that great. That don't mean he going to give you money, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, shit. Where's so my baby daddy is the bitch in the life. I'm just trying to tell you. It's okay, y'all. I used to be the man in a lifetime. Apparently, I used to be a pimp. You heard? Uh -uh. You feel me? I got a bunch of hoes. All my men's, all the guys that I've ever dated, they all, you know, ah, uh ah, -uh. they all be a little girly. I be slapping that ass. I be like, I get it. You remember when I used to be your daddy? We switch roles. I get it. It all makes sense because the way my ex used to ask me for money, I used to be like, am I, am I your daddy? Or am, what's going on here? I'm not an, I'm really daddy Warbucks. Like my grandmother be asking me for money. Everybody asking me for money. I, I swear to you. I'm, I'd be like, does, what about me gives that, da oh, daddy Warbucks. Like I thought I was giving Annie. I'm trying to give Annie because I'm just trying to give, I'm trying to give Annie. You feel me? For the next seven years, I'm trying to give Annie so I could get to that bag. You feel me? Like, <laughs> like that's what I'm, they so, I'm just trying to tell you. I figured it out so it made sense. And then once he understood that, because, you know, I had to teach him. He was he didn't like that. He got offended. He was offended. Oh, you disrespected me. Really? Because you do a lot of girly things. I'm just saying. <laughs> so um, he always said, oh, you disrespected me, Shirley. Um, so I was like, okay, well, when you start until then, I'll be your daddy. And you already know. You feel me? Um, you do, I'm just saying, like, how do I give daddy Warbucks? Like, I have, like, I've been trying to give Annie, y'all. I've been trying to give Annie the, the little orphan for the longest, bro. <laughs> I'm just saying. Anyways, but yeah, I just want you to know that. That's how, um, how do you know, how do you know if you give daddy energy? Well, it's a long story, y'all. But usually when you have a very stronger Mars than your man, <laughs> it's going to happen. Um, also, when your Jupiter is close to your sun. I wonder, wait, what's the baby? I got to look at the baby's chart now because now I'm curious. All right, I'm going to look at the baby and I'm out of here. I'm going to save this so it won't be that long as a rant. I started getting into a rant. Um, okay, I got to see this shit. Let's see. Let's look at this. I trust this website. These are the, I remember these people. Hello? Okay, let's see. Um, okay, let's go back up here because I can't really see it. Okay, so he has the sun. I don't know what this man has. Let's go down here because I can't read that shit. Okay, so he has the sun in Capricorn. What else is in Capricorn? Uranus and Neptune in Capricorn. Yo, there's a whole generation of people that have their sun next to the to these two planets, the outer planets. Which give them a very sparky uh, personality. This is it. This is he's a perfect example because look, Neptune is how he's been able to get that creative thing. But then there's that other side of him that we don't know. He's like a Gemini. You know what's funny? The baby gives mad Gemini energy. And he really do, which makes sense. Okay, that makes kind of sense. Okay, he has a moon in Cancer, which is funny because the the whatever Danny. She also has a moon in Cancer. This is what made them get together right here. This Cancer moon and his Cancer moon, they're the horniest people in the Zodiac. If I, if you wanted me to. Yes, he does. He gives more Gemini than fucking... Um, no, no, Kanye gives Gemini. Let me... I was going to say something. Because uh, you're the... He gives mad Gemini. Um, but anyways, yeah, this is what made them get together. So he has that Cancer moon so that made them horny that's they they were thinking with this right here that's you want me to tell you that um what else has they got in common so let's see cancers you got a sagittarius mercury look she got a mercury in capricorn like him right and he has a mercury in sagittarius like her so she's a sagittarius son plus she's a foreigner she's spanish you get it so sagittarius so I think, I think they got something Virgo. If I'm not mistaken, maybe she is a Pisces rising. Maybe. I don't know. 
But now from the what I'm seeing is Mercury. I think that Danny could be a Pisces rising, and then that's probably why we don't like her because she has a Saturn up there. Um, and that would make her delusional enough to think that ha that we would like her after the Yellow Bone song, or that he was gonna stay with her when she became the mother, which is Mercury and Capricorn. Mm. All right, we'll get back to that. Uh, then he has Venus and Scorpio. She has Venus and Scorpio too. Okay, so they they have the same love language. They're basically each other's twin. She he has a Mars and Sagittarius. He has a better Mars than she do. So his Mars, which is the a masculine energy, goes over her Jupiter. This is why she wanted him to be the one. Girl, because that is not the... Okay. Um, then, look, he has a Jupiter and Virgo. That's why his luck be running out. Notice how the baby, he be hitting numbers, and all of a sudden he be, he was gone, or the luck ran out. Is this because he has a weak Jupiter? His luck ran out on that. Remember, and I thought he... Didn't he kill somebody? Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, can somebody explain? <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry. Wait, did the baby kill somebody? I got to relax this thing on the... Baby killed somebody. Okay, so yeah, yes, okay, yes. So see, so apparently he did kill somebody for self defense. <sighs> Honestly, I'd believe him. Yes, in Walmart. Uh, yes, he did. He did kill somebody. I believe him. I do think it's self defense. Why he doesn't have 22 degrees? Okay, and it's not in a fixed sign. He does have 18 degrees, which is, this is unfortunate. Um, 18 degrees means mean or bad people and is in the moon. So that means the people that he meets are mean or bad. Then he has mad mutable placements. Sag, Virgo, Sag. <laughs> then he does have another killer degree that a lot of people don't talk about is the eight degree Scorpio. I am going to save this, y'all. Um, this uh, uh, mutable. No, it's not a murder. It's not murder. If it's in a Gemini placement, if you have 22 degrees and mutable, it's not murder. But if it wasn't fixed, that's murder. That's a fact. Um, I do believe him. I do believe him, but that's okay. You don't, you could be around him. You don't have to, um, you don't have to, what I was going to say. I have 22 degrees and 18 degrees. I'll be around them, Shillis. You heard? You heard? I'll be around them. I don't be doing them. You feel me? But I'll be around them. You feel, we, we, They see me mobbing. Yeah, I used to be a dangerous person. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. But you know who I think is a killer? Let me show you who I think is a killer. These are the people that I think are killers. These are the people that I think are killers. These are the people that I do think are killers. And let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. I don't think he did it with his hands, though. I think he ordered the call. Let me tell you why, though. Let me tell you why, though. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, they changed his chart. This is not his chart. These are the reasons why I think he's a killer. I can see it. Um, not the engine. Yeah, not. Trust me. Listen. Trust me when I tell you. Boom, boom, boom. Trust me when I'm tell you. Boom, boom, boom. XRP, Cheryl's. XRP. Wait a second. What about XRP? Don't do that to me. Wait. What about XRP?
No, I did not. I'm, I didn't go through all the signs. I'm going to do a video about it, by the way. I'm going to do a video. This is just a rant. I'm going to go. I'm going to do the video about. Whoa. I w I'm going to go do the Gemini season on TikTok. Okay. So if you want to hear all the signs, Gemini season, I'm going to do it on TikTok for y'all. Okay. Because that way you can able to uh, um, scroll through Instagram and you could do your thing and then listen to me as well. You heard. So I will be going on Insta on TikTok and I'm going to do all the signs and I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to finish this right here, which is Capricorn and all their aspects. So I'm going to do that. I'm almost done. I got, I'm into Sagittarius so right here. We're right here. We're at the Chris one. So go to my TikTok because that way when, when I go live there, you can able to scroll. Hang on, y'all. Yo. You'll be able to scroll your diggy. Okay, go to my TikTok. Oh, hang on. Go to my TikTok. The reason why I say go to TikTok, I could go live here. Don't look at that. Sorry, y'all. I could go live here and you get to scroll on your phone. Look at that. Look at that. You get to scroll on your phone. My, I know he did. My intuition shouts loud every time. Listen, I know he did. The moment I, I just know he did. I looked at his chart a long time ago and I know he did. I just, I know he did. There's a lot of reasons why. One, this degree right here. He has a very powerful scammer degree or deceptive degree because one is in Neptune and it's also in Sag, which comes with natural born wisdom and it's retrograde. So I, I think, and mind you, by the way, there's a lot of mutable. There's Gemini. And I'm going to tell you something. Gemini is more scary than a Scorpio, <laughs> to be quite honest. Um, you two also as FYI. Wait, what? Flag girl. No way, baby. So, we're almost, I'm almost done with this, y'all. This is my little, I'm going to post it. This is going to be a little post that I'm doing. I just be writing on the little sticky notes. Um, You know, I'd be reading that. Uh, Yes, yeah, so there's a, yeah, you always said that these are the type of men Angela tracks in her chart. Yes, look, uh, most serial killers, more serial killers are Geminis. Mind you, look. Let's think about Angela Simmons' first baby daddy. Okay, there's a is a uh, let me look at her shit real quick. Think about Angela Simmons' first baby daddy. Jupiter, look, Jupiter's retrograde, twenty eight degrees. Look, 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 Jupiter's retrograde. Are y'all listening? First, her baby. Wait, why is Gemini scarier than a Scorpio? I'm going to tell you that right now. Hang on. Hang that thought, and I'm going to leave with this, okay? Other stuff, though. I don't know if I can't record, though. though. It's okay. I'm going to check it out. I have a co composite that's a karmic relationship. Look, she has a Jupiter retrograde, 28 degrees, which obviously you know her dad is MC, whatever her name, you know, Adidas. I'm sorry. And it's making an, it's an exact trine to Uranus at 22 degrees. With Saturn, her father built the foundation. Him, remember, twenty-two degrees is a foundational degree, and also her baby daddy got killed. Now I don't know how he got killed. Let's look it up real quick because I forgot. Angela Simmons, uh, baby daddy. He got look. He was shot and killed in twenty eighteen. Uh, by who though? They ever said who? Who the fuck is the per did, it, did they ever say who did it? Man who killed. There we go. Man who killed. Blah blah blah. Justice is served. Blah blah blah. Surrounded by police. Blah blah blah. Wait, what? Okay, five year old just outside. Michael was fairly shot by Sutton, former fiance. Wait, what? Shot Sutton Simmons, former fiance. Father of Michael. Oh, okay. I'm like, I couldn't read that. Who the hell is Michael? They didn't tell us who Michael was. Sorry, y'all. The guy was charged. Gemini gives off dolphin vibes. Um. Oh, here we go. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Tensa was shot and killed outside of his home. Blah, blah, blah. They don't say who the guy was. And look up his lawyer at the time was. Wait, last less than a week. Tensa's death. William surrendered himself to local police. 
Hmm. This is suspicious. I don't know. You know what a man is willing to do to be with a woman? Because no lie, Joe, G Joe Gotti has been wanting to be with Angela Simmons for years, okay? She, like, he been talking about this chick for years. But anyways, what I wanted to tell you is, look, look at this. Jupiter rules the husband or the person that her man um is making a trying to uranus uranus rules friends yo Gotti and young dolph were associated as friends you i hope that makes sense look mind you her mars is at 17 degrees what up y'all the situation was quiet so he ordered the call too i don't know I don't know. I don't know. But that shit that he had that song rake up in 27 and dropped that line. Okay. But look, look. So he dropped that line 2017. The guy dies 2018. His person who kills him. Right. Just goes and surrender himself to the local police. When in the hood have you ever heard about that? And I'm not for nothing, but I don't know. It's giving, look, I don't know, Joe Gotti. And you bold too. Is this like a bold society or something? Let me see something. Yo, no, why am I putting you? Yo, Gotti. Is this a bold society? That's, I'm just saying, I'm not speculating things, but look, I'm just saying, Jupiter is at 22 degrees it's making um with that uranus they were friends mind you mars is also rules this aries so look mars rules the jupiter right and mars is on a mutable sign look and this is a celebrity 17 degrees rules a celebrity person which he is all right and he's i'm just saying i don't know i don't know maybe i'm just speculating it's all speculations all speculation and it's cool because look she got k2 and venus together so she's like um she's like what's her name and uh anna nicole smith and bitches that have this they tend to be taken care of um next life i need to be these bitches okay thank you all right love you all sorry um i will leave it all this is it i'm gonna leave this i'm gonna post this allegedly this is all allegedly um uh, you know, this is all allegedly, we're not, I'm not speculating anything, but we are, okay? So anyways, I'm going to post this later. Find me on TikTok around 12 o'clock, y'all. We're going to do all the signs, Gemini season and Saturn, okay? Love you all. Appreciate that.